What's going on, y'all, boy? I had a long discussion with myself, and I decided it is still worthwhile to do this season. I may just have it in the back burner. Now, the question, 14 games, I feel like it's fine. If I'll do another season eventually. Um, This is the settings. We got Fantasy Draft Order on, Fixed, All-NBA, 5-game series. I feel like that's the best. No team chemistry. I don't do team chemistry because I want teams to just play to win. Role changes are on. I'll just look at them. The highest money, so I don't have good players in free agency. Um, play a role in team success. I don't know, because I'm like, play a role... I guess, but team success? Like, I'd want team success to be a factor so people will go sign a good team, so I'll leave that at 50. Trade logic on. I turned off recently signed restriction, recently traded restriction. This is going to be like, probably this, I'll have this season for as long as there's not a good 2K. So, (laughs) so I don't have to play 2K18. This is just this is just a backup option. I put the Euro stash discount. It's at 95. I didn't. I didn't change it. New signing premium. I just upped it by one. Untouchables premium upped it by one. I'm like players that were recently signed. Like I'm like, how is it gonna make it harder for me? I guess it would make it harder for me if I couldn't trade for players that were recently signed easily. If the CPU just wasn't budging at all for a new player signing premium and untouchables premium, because like for new, so like, because what I usually do is like right after free agency, I'll wait for somebody to sign their deal and I'll trade for them. So I, I moved it up from 25 to 26. If I wanted to make it OD, I'd push this to 100 and I'd push this to 100. Um, just so maybe I'll push it up to 51. Should I? Well, I guess it's my decision to make right now because Caleb is busy. If I push new player signing premium up to 51, I would really have to build my teams through the draft. Let me just push it up to 51, yeah. This way is going to make it a lot more difficult for me. I'm going to actually, yeah, I'm going to say teams that sign their free agents... I'm like new, like untouchables. I'll push this to like 99. But new player signing, I'll leave it at 51. Most people do want to keep the new players that they signed. Because let's look at the NBA this past year. We'll use this 2023 season as an example. I can't really think of new player. Yeah, if you, they were recently signed, and I'm hoping recently signed means like right at the beginning of the season or right after they signed a new deal. Because there aren't too many sign and trades. Was Brad Beal signed and trade? No, he was just traded. Like it is not crazy. So I'm going to just leave it at 51. Because I don't want to take the sign and trade option away. And I just want to make it more difficult for myself trade frequencies at 61 there's no recently traded draft picks I pushed this to zero so it's just more about a rating being important oh yep we've already seen this the discounts I don't know I didn't touch any of that I didn't touch this either I'm like if I was gonna guess like which which players people value like to I don't know like to beat me you're gonna need a little bit of I would I would say the least valuable player player would be a playmaker but if you don't have anyone that can dribble I'm just gonna steal it from you so and if you're like pick importance (sighs) you know what let's put the selling team values to pick the most they're not getting rid of their pick. A rebuilding team. If that's at 37, I'd want this to be at 35. 
You know what? Let's make this easy. I'll put you at 30. Oh, I can't. Well, then let's get you at 35. And then if you're a buying team and a contending team, let's do 27 and 25. Can I get 27,500? And then 25, two zeros. Yep, perfect. I just like I like the way that looks. Pick depreciation. Like one year before its draft. Will people trade it? That's more of a win now thing. I'm going to leave that as it is because... Like, people might be like, okay, we don't mind trading a pick all the way down the road. Or well, people want to keep their picks. Do I want the CPU to keep their picks so they can draft? Low key. But, uh, but this isn't like a 90%. I don't, I don't know. No, this is what I'm saying. Like, total asset value versus lineup impact I'm just gonna leave this out of this I don't wanna touch that and I changed this um, do I want players to get I think the in season training is a little bit cheese cause I don't think the CPUs do it so I'm actually and so I, so I can save my own time I'm gonna just put zero to training effects. Well, it was at 50. I feel like training effects is a little bit cheese though. The CPU players like don't really get too good throughout the season. This is just something that helps me out. Okay, let me push this to 33 yeah I feel like that's fair uh, I'm gonna leave that as it is and yeah so let's get into it um might as well just be the Hawks in the heat I'll use their team everything's manual so I'll put the Grizzlies will get the second pick the Blue Trailblazers get the third heat will get pick one and the Hawks will get picked the last one. Oh, it's already got it set up for me. What? And I think I'll do the draft and then I'll take a break. This this will be like a long form season, man. It's gonna take I'm just gonna be really just playing this on the back end when I don't got much else going on for me. All these Eastern teams. Okay, let me not make the West too sweet. Oh, I already put the Trailblazers and the Grizzlies up there. Yeah. Right, let me put them at 10. Let me put somebody at 7. Let me put... Yeah, somebody at 7. Just so the Rockets will be the last team. Um, and then the rest will be East. Because I don't want the East to be too top-heavy. Where it's like, oh my gosh, the East is sweet. I mean, once I get to the finals, it's sweet. That's how it usually is for these seasons. And it's unfortunate that it comes to that point. Where I'm like, oh man. When I get to the finals, it's sweet. So, my thing is, I'll compare, I'll, my gosh, Giannis on the last year of his deal. I don't even want to know, I don't even know if I want Giannis. So the thing about this season, let me give let me give y'all detail. I have two teams. The Hawks are my main team. Heat are just the team I use. Um, does he have a player option or what's going on here? 
I know I have his bird rights. This is kind of scary. Giannis on a one year? That's kind of scary. Nobody's really under contract except for Dame. And Cat. Maybe I can get Giannis and Cat. I'm definitely going to get Giannis. Let's see where Cat goes. So for the Hawks, I know how I play. I need a slasher. Let's view detail. I want. No. Ooh, Levine would be good, I think. Let's see his badges. Fast break finisher, contact, relentless. No posterizer. Oh, mm, I don't know. Wiggins? Okay, so Zach Levine and Wiggins, I'm thinking. Levine's on a two year, Wiggins on a. It's about the same. DeMar? Is there no posterizer in this game? I haven't seen anybody with it. I think we will go Levine. I'm not even going to really think about it. 95 driving dunk. I think for. We'll. We'll team up Giannis and Clay. I feel like that's a good, it's a good duo. Now for me, is Wiggins still here? Wiggins is not here. Okay. Ma Glenn Robinson. I don't know. I'm kind of. Let's get our big. Let's get our big. Let's get our big man. We need a big man that can move a little bit. Mo Bamba. He's small. Mo Bamba seven, seven foot. He's a seventy nine. Let's go. Let's go get Mo Bamba. Let's go get Mo Bamba. Let's go get Mo Bamba. I like. I like that. He's like fast, fast. And he's on a three year deal. I like that. Now, should we go get. We got. We need a guard. If we, especially if we have Giannis playing center. Oh, what bad does this John Wall have? Well, that was prime John Wall, too. Okay. Like, I'm like. We'd want to accumulate talent, but. From 84 to 80, if I'm really like trying to view detail, like McCullum, so we'd like McCullum, that's good. Buddy Heald is good, and DeJounte Murray. Those are the three players I'm really thinking about. McCullum, he's 29. Is he going to start regressing? Because if I look at this is for the CPU team. Like, Drew Holiday, no, I'm not going to get him on a one year. I'm not going to get LaMarcus. McCollum for four. So we have a lineup of Clay at the three, McCollum at the two. We still don't have a point guard. Do we get Eric Bunson? No. But I'm like, if we had to, like, I like Buddy Heel. Well, like, what's the look at the age difference? It's twenty nine. It's a two year age difference. I'm like, I think McCullum at thirty three is not gonna fall off a cliff. He's got twenty nine bad. He's got. Let's look at tendencies. Let's look at tendencies a little bit. Shot tendencies at eighty. Both of them have eighty shot tendency. Um. Let's look at three point shot three tendency seventy four ninety nine ninety nine. So Buddy's gonna get those threes up. Let's look at badges. This will really be the last terminer. I don't feel like these layup badges is really moving the needle. When I look at shooting, they both got catch and shoot on gold. He's got corner gold. 
Flexible release, I don't know if that's going to help the CPU any. Hot Zone Hunter's good. Steady Shooter's good. I might go Buddy, honestly. And he's younger? He's got Dead Eyes, though, and difficult. Wait, 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 wait. See, that's the thing. Let's look at the gold badges. Catch and shoot, good. Clutch shooter, I like that. Corner, I like that. Dead eye, I like that. Difficult shots, I like that. Green machine, I like that. Hot star, I like that. Hot zone, I like that. Slippery apple, I like that. Steady shooter, I like it. I don't know, bro. This is a tough decision. My gut says Buddy healed because he's going to shoot the threes. Let's look at tendencies one more time. Because it's like, I don't see off the dribble three. Contested jumper three is a 70, 36. Let's go McCullum. I like McCullum. Let's see when Buddy goes. Buddy's still on the board. Oh, he went 10th. He's on Brooklyn. Okay. My team... We got Mo Bamba and Levine. Is there any way? We got Mo Bamba and Levine. I wouldn't. Are we gonna? We're gonna run one big. Let's try to get like um a good speed with ball guy. Cause I know like when I'm looking when I'm thinking three pointer. Let's look at three point. Where is three point? Three point. Where are you? What? Is that not here? It might not be here. It's not. Okay. When I look at three. Oh, I press Y to get there. Okay. Um, yeah, we got JJ Reddick is here. Duncan Robinson. We got a. There's a lot of shooters here. I'm not too worried about getting a shooter. So, um, so I want somebody with, with some speed on them. You know what I'm talking about? A little bit of speed on them that we can cheese a little bit with to really, that's Josh Okogie, a PL, 90 plus, that's decent, George, oh no, no, uh-uh. Uh, oh, Kogi, I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Oh, Kogi, I don't know, man. I don't want speed just for speed because it's not going to be any beneficial if we can get by our man and not finish. Okay, let me... Yeah, this isn't good. We only got Levine and Mo. Okay, let's try it. We got we to gotta support Levine with some mocks. Is perimeter defense here? Let's let's look at speed with ball. Jared yeah. Is perimeter defense here? We can get Pat Bev. I might be good. We can really like put Levine at the three or something. Clamps. D leader. Trapper, I like that badge. Intimidator. Oh, can I see? We can't see by badges? Let me see the guards with Intimidator. No. Ah. Ah. I think we've got Mo Bamba, we got Levine, we got to get defense. I think I want defenders under contract, low key. 
let me because I need role players at this point maybe let me go get Matisse Thibel 97 steel let me let me like yeah let me go get a Matisse Thibel let me look at the bigs though real quick so let, maybe I'll go secure my backup big man 78 speed 86 82 Ron Day though, can you rebound though? Oh that's yeah, can you rebound? I don't know if I'm getting jiggy with that seventy something rebound with no vert. None of y'all can rebound. And at the center Willie can kind of rebound. Okay, let's see the best re D rebounder available is Pow. What? Then D Jordan, no speed. When can we get into the 70 speeds? Dwight? 34 year old Dwight? I don't know. That's not a... Yeah, I need to get my big man. Robert Williams, 75 speed. We, that may be as good as it gets. But he's 6'8 in this game? I don't six eight is short. Six eight is really short, bro, for two K. Bowl bowl eighty four, but sixty eight speed. <sighs> Willie's got seventy seven speed and a eighty eighty three D rebound with seventy seven speed. Let's like let's really compare Robert Williams and I gotta get them boys side by side. I gotta get them boys. Robert Williams and Willie Colley Stein. Where's Rob? Is he high? Let's go to re can I start by rebound? There he is at 85. 85 to 83. So he's... But Will... I don't know, bro. This is a tough decision. Can I see potential? B plus potential? B plus? He's 27 and 7 foot? He's 23? I feel like, I feel like, let's look at badges, this, this will be the determining factor, rebound is only on silver, intimidator on bronze, no rebound, no intimmy, see now I gotta go get my interior defense big man bro, I might just go get Robert Williams cause I don't think any of these dudes can really protect the rim. Like I want. The white can, but do I just draft the big man next year? The white and DeAndre Jordan can do the job, but they're gonna be so slow and really limit our offense. Ed Davis has Hall of Fame rebound chaser. Oh my gosh, this is no good. This like really is tough. We need a big. We need a big. The go because right now we got Zach Levine and Mo Bamba. Let's look at Mo Bamba. He's just he's gonna be our starting big. He can't rebound. And he can't, um, what's it? He can't rebound. He can't protect the rim. We don't need. We need a big that can rebound and protect the rim. I think that's. I think that's Dwight. I really think that might be Dwight. Let's let's go by. Let's go by block. Oh, maybe it's it's probably Brook Lopez. 
Intimidator, Room Protector, but no re... I kind of like that Intimidator on gold. I think... If I get... Can he shoot though? Brook Lopez can kind of shoot. This three. 73... Uh, I like that Intimidator on gold, though. I really do. Because I feel like Intimi on gold. I feel like we'll let the rebounds figure themselves out. Okay, my other team. Giannis, Clay Thompson, and C mid. We're looking at Alf Horford, Bojan, Karras, D. Jordan. We're looking at this group of guys. Probably Karras Levert or Larry Nick. It's really... Probably Karis LeVert. He's probably got some good potential too. Yeah, A minus. Bro, I'm. We're kind of in a tough spot. We got our. We got a guard. We got two backup. We got two bigs. We're probably gonna go. See if Robert Williams is still here. I think he's not. Yeah, he's not. He would have been our big we develop. Um, let's get some shooters. I think now is the time to invest in our wings. JJ. We're really like catch and shoot on gold is the bare men. A lot of people have catch and shoot on gold. Do we? We don't want people on one-year deals. I don't know about Steph Curry on a. That's a lot of money for Steph Curry. Like if I look at Doug McDermott, I don't know. I don't want people that are just going to get bopped on offense, though. Thirteen badges is pretty. I think we're going to go for shooters with badges. Scary Terry. He's only got two. Mark Gasol. He's got a bunch, but he's a big. Norman Powell's only got one. We're not going Surge. Twelve shooting badges is pretty good, Luke. I think we will just go ahead and get um, Duncan. Do we need defenders? One second. Okay, Okogi, you might you might have found a spot on our team. Wait, 96 speed at 6, 4. 86 at 6, 6. Any, there's, PJ's got 86. Cam Radish has 85. I don't know, Cam Radish might be our pick here get our power forward right here and now with someone hot start 
what's his attribute for three? Seventy six. Someone we can at least, you know, put on the court. I should have put twenty we should have played a twenty nine game season. We definitely should have played a twenty nine game season and I kicked the minutes up to six minutes a game. I think it's bent, ain't it? Oh, they're all bent. I like Cam Reddish as a pick here. I think I will go Cam. <coughs> I think they're gonna lock out their rotation. They still don't have a PG. Should they get their backup big or get another score? Mm. Will Barton's only got six badges. Let's see how let's see his tendencies. He's not really gonna shoot the ball. Look at his badges. Doesn't do anything particularly. He's just a good solid player. Like having surge, maybe I'm leaning towards surge. Unless if Will Barton is really like gonna come out here and put up shots, sixty shot tendency. Yeah, no, we're gonna go get surge. We'll do a rental of surge e blocker. Okay, so, oh, Will Barton is still here. We're, I don't think we're going to pick him up on our team. Because we might, we need to start. Oh, dang it, I should have grabbed Matisse Stiebel. Does he have glove? I mean, pickpocket? He does, he has it on gold. He might be one of the last people to have it on gold. Let's go ahead and get Chris done. Easy Will Barton pick. Um, they've got their starting five already lined up. This is good for them. Um, we are going to... Duncan Robinson's gone, which is unfortunate. So since he's gone... We need speed. We need we need one more six four. I don't know. We need like a six. Peach, but he's got no badges. Oh, we're getting into the slow pokes. Oh, six seven. Catch and shoot on silver. Can't play defense though. Seku. You got a little bit of defense on him for 80. 82 speed though. That's a little too slow for me. For what I'm looking for. I might go get. Uh, Okogi. And just have him be small. Yeah, they got a good six, man. They just don't have a... I guess CJ will run the one. And Will Barton and Giannis, they'll all swap opportunities. And then since we have our main lineup set, let's try to get some... Okay, so... If I sort by potential that way, it's not good. Or that way, it's not good. 
SETI B plus potential now Uh, B potential no. I don't see like any elite young players really. Seku, Luca, Nasar, Lito. Then like I don't see no like Nick Claxton. He, you know, that's decent, but I don't think they're going to give him... He's got B potential. There's Jordan Poole. I guess he's on a 1 plus 1. There's Anthony Simons. I guess he's on, what, a 1 plus 1? Like, I don't know how these deals are. Like, not seeing them locked up into something long term. I just don't love it. Alright, who's... I guess he's... I want to fill the rest of the roster up. Is 24 as old as I'll go? Josh Hart's 25. I don't know. Is that cool? A potential? Might as well, right? We need some. All right, it's time for us to get Reddick. We want a young seventy-five plus guy. Tony Bradley, I don't know. They're saying Tony Bradley's better though. Grant Williams, that's a good player. 6'6 six, six power forward, 240 though. Lord have mercy. I guess we'll go. We do still need a guard. We need a young guard. Do we think Anferny will be waiting for us? <laughs> Let's just go ahead and take Anferny. I like that. Oh, I like that Anferny pick. Now we need to let's get two more shooters. Six shooting badges. Catch and shoot corner. He's gonna get bopped on offense though. Nobody has any D badges. Except for Mark Gasol. No, no dual threats. Mike Conley a little bit. Urson. Oh, Danny. We can go. Let's go. Let's go pick us up a Danny Green. 
I like that. I like a little Danny Green pickup. Okay. But well, we're the... This team, we're running a six-man. So, otherwise, we're stacking up young talent. Now, at this point, it's just like, let's take the best young guy available. We want a 75-plus young guy. Until we get to 24... Well, maybe, you know, 28 is their prime, so we'll stop at 24. Trey Lyles and Noah Vonley. How many years in the league you had, my boy? You've been in the league since 2014, 2015. Six years. Five years. Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know, Chief. I don't know, Chief. I don't know. I got to think about it. If it's not them, shit, would I want to sign people making a lot of money? So, a little money? Should I try to orchestrate some trades? Like, I don't know here. Let's see if I can get like a D, like Royce O'Neal. Let's look like, let's see the white power. Like, let's look at the three year deal people. Just in case if I lose some people in free agency and I can only come in with 70s. Dwight Powell and Maxi Kleber are interesting. He's a stretch four. I guess I'd go with the stretch four. See if Dwight Powell gets picked up. Well, wow, Dwight Powell's going to be on the board still? Oh, that's a fleece. The, um, the Hawks... Ooh, let me not do that. The Hawks are a little bit boned. We are. Um, we have no direction. Uh, we need to get another 3 and D wing. Is that Mark Gasol? Yeah, that's Mark Gasol. Which... Let's, let's pick up Marcus. I think that's a good pickup. Oh. Because if we come out, we could come out. No, we could come out with uh, Mark Gasol, Zach Levine, Reddick, Danny Green. Yeah, let's go get Mark Gasol. Let's go get Mark Gasol. Twenty-five point six million. Dwight Powell, easy pick. Now, should we try to get young players? I feel like what we'll need. Let's see speed with ball. Sure, I don't want to sign people on two-way deals. I really don't. Let's look at speed itself. Let's look at steel. Gary Payton a second. That's intriguing. Or you got no badges. Look at steel. This is pretty intriguing. Pickpocket on silver. No 14. Mm. Pickpocket on silver, though? I don't know, my friend. I don't know. Pickpocket on silver? I don't know, my friend. I don't know. I don't know if that's going to be. Is that Jalen Green? Oh, Javante Green. 
Of course, of course. I don't know. Pickpocket on silver? I don't know. I don't know. 2K21? Who was a rookie? Who was after John Morant? That's Aunt Edwards in them, right? 2020. Is this the bubble year? This is a Giannis year. This was an Anthony Edwards. They're not in the game. The 2020 draft players and the boys are not in the game, unfortunately. <sighs> like I knew we were missing some people. Um, I don't know who's going to get rookie of the year. I don't know how that's going to work out. Maybe... You know what I need, you know what I'm looking into? Let's get a young player with some decent badges. I want to see something on gold. Fast break finisher, that's not a good that's not a good badge to have. I'm sorry. I'm gonna stop looking. I'm I'm done looking. We need a good wing that can defend. Roberson, no. Tory Craig, no. Al Farouk, no. Bishmak. Um. Let's look. Should we get another big? I should have done a 29 game season. I'm feeling a little regretful about that. I think I think these will be much longer games. I think I might do eight minute quarters. I do think eight minute quarters. So I so I'll need a complete team. And just not play as many, not like not speed run it. I should have done a 29 game season. I really should have, so I could play every team once. But 14, that's fine. It is what it is. It's life. Yeah. So we just have the Eastern Conference, Western Conference, and we just meet in the championship. Instead of having the Western, instead of having the top heavy East beat all the Western Conference teams. Um, I don't know, cause we so so. If I'm gonna play eight minute quarters, we're gonna need a bench. Let me see if I can get another slasher. Actually, that's a good thing. Tyler Johnson, Jeff. Let's see if I can get another dunk. That really is Hamidou. Hamidou Diallo. I get like. Let's look at him and Jalen Lequeux. 79 speed with ball. Alright, how am I do? You've made the team. Um Taj Gibson? Oh no no. We're going young. We're we're going very young. Nas Reed. What was I doing? I forgot, man. I was not locked in. 
We got Anthony and Seku. No, three. That's a pretty good pickup at 21. Oh, let's look. There's a couple 75 pluses in here. Let's look at the age. Pal, we don't need Pal. We don't need Al Farouk. Herman Gomez, that's interesting. But he's probably hit his ceiling. Nas Reed, Lou Dort. Isaiah Hartenstein is a 73. With no badges. A minus potential though. Lou Dort. B minus. Let's get Isaiah Hartenstein. Now. The Heat are very big man oriented. They've got all types of bigs. Austin Rivers. Now, let's think. If I'm going to try to have a team with a, a wee bit of a bench. <laughs> We've got Hamidou to be the backup. Zach Levine. We'll, let's go get another big. Let's get... Let's try to get a fast center. Maybe a rebound guy. Not a power joking. Bro. We don't need no rentals. We know speed is going to mean a lot in this. 74, 80 speed Turian Prince or 76. Let's look at their rebound. He's got 77 D rebound. These boys can't rebound. Where's a lick? the first guy that can that's better than 77 D rebound drew Eubanks and he's slow right 61 speed 80 block is it really MKG 76 speed no block but 77 D rebound that's close enough I think it is Michael Kidd Gilchrist like the last the literally one of the last guys off the bench On holiday. Wesley Matthews. Oh, this is the other team. Lou Dort is interesting at 71 overall. These dudes are 71. Are any of these dudes 73 or 74? Yeah, then Lou Dort is the obvious pick here. I forgot where he went to school. How long has he been in the league? <laughs> okay, we're tr it's time to draft some backups. It's time to draft some backups. We need a high steel backup. That is something we need. We need another reacher. Or a lane guy. It really might. It's Gary Payton, I guess, because I don't think anybody has. He's got silver interceptor. Yeah, it's. I guess let me go ahead and probably just get. Let's look at block. See if anybody's got any in Timmy. Let's look at rebound. What if we need um. Like Ed Davis, that's like a pick. We need thirty one. Thirty one was gold rebound chaser though. That's pretty nice. But he probably could lose that next year. I don't know if Rebound Chaser is really going to move the needle too crazily for us. I think we got to go court, but he's 34. He could lose his interceptor. Oh my gosh. Like, common sense says go Gary Payton. And he's a lot. F Let me go Gary Payton.
Oh, is it? We running low on seven? No, we got a bunch of seventy pluses. They just all older. Oh, that's Justin. I thought it was Jaron Jackson Jr. I like John Cox now. Maybe Justin Jackson wouldn't be too terrible. B potential. I don't know, what do y'all think? Or we can just go... He's 25, right? Where's Justin Jackson? Bro, I just saw, buddy. There goes Kyle Corver just sitting there. That's he was on a long term deal. Alonzo, yeah, none of these dudes are good. I'm trying to think. So he's 24. He's a 25 year old, 72. We're saying we can get a 23 year old. Yes, yeah, so I'll take the 23 year old, 71. So Justin James, Kai Bowman, Admiral Schofield. Are there any 22 year old, 71s? Or 22 year old, 70s? Yeah, Jalen McDaniels. We may just go ahead and get him. There any twenty one year old sixties? If not, we'll just go ahead and get See we're like twenty year old sixty eight. We got a 20 year old 68 C plus or a 22 year old 70. I'm gonna go with Jalen McDaniels. If Jalen McHugh's there, we'll get him. Let's see if he's gonna be there. Looks like he will. Oh, oh yeah, Kyle Corver's right here. I think that it would be foolish not to go ahead and grab him now, just so nobody else can have him, and then we'll go. I think it's the best option to go ahead and get Jalen LeCue. The last pick. Who can really help us? We've got a backup reacher, a backup slasher. We got a lot of shooters. I guess a backup. I'm going to just look at badge and see who's got a badge I like. Rebound chip. We. I need mean, like I don't know. I like the gold rebound chaser. I really do. Like y'all don't y'all don't understand that gold rebound chaser is really enticing. It's really got me feeling like hey, we can we can come out here and get something done with that. Like it could but I don't want him like he could come out here and really we could put him at the center, have him close out possessions. At least for a year. Like, this is like, we are looking bad. This has got to be one of my worst drafts of all time. 
I like Ed. Okay, if we're not... Do I need anyone that can get it done in the mid-range? No. Let's look. Let's look at physicals. Because speed is going to... Oh, is that draw foul? Campaign? Thanasis? None of y'all can dribble? Speed with ball? I don't want Jared Harper. I don't want somebody on a two-way. Y'all know this. Tipping passes, Kenrich. Put back boss, Yogi. I don't know. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Prim D. What display making badges? Path perception, 81. I don't. Mm. It's like, do we need a rebounder, or are we going to just get Thabo, somebody that might be able to help us out on defense? Or do we just go get Ed Davis? Or do we get P.J. Dozier, 6'6", 86 overall? Big man wise... Is Ed, let's see, okay, if Ed Davis is athletic, it's between him and P.J. Dozier. That's what it is, really. I want to see his speed. A 65 speed? Is that one of the fastest for the centers? He's not like a gazelle out there or anything. 65 speed. Brooke Lopez has 20. He's not going to be able to move. Okay. Yep. I got to get him. I got to get Ed Davis. I'm sorry, buddy. The other guy. PJ, I wanted to get you. Bro, Brooke. Oh, my God. Bro. Y'all don't understand. Buddy's not going to be able to move. First off, first things first, I want to come up here. I'm going to up the minutes. We're going to play, I think, eight minutes is fine with me. Eight minutes so the, the CPU can play. I mean, I have to have a full team. I usually do a lot less minutes a game. But I'm doing this so the CPU can play. I mean, so I have to have a full rotation. Foul out, we'll keep it at... We'll actually push the foul out. I'm thinking foul out at four. We'll do five. We'll do five. We'll do five. We'll do five. Anything... We'll do eight and ten. We're not going to normalize anything. Um, I want it to be custom. Level one. Wait. No, oh, fuck it. Oh, sorry. Excuse me. Excuse my French. All right. So the first thing I want to come to the heat and just see. You know, what can we get for it, Clay? See, is what I'm talking about. The CPU ain't giving me nothing sweet. Why is Clay popping up here as at 89? It's crazy. What's going on, Caleb? Uh, why is Clay popping up as an 89? Let's see. I'm just curious. What can that package? Them 80... Yeah, the CPU's pretty smart now, boy. The C... Kill, I up the CPU's trades. So they wouldn't be so foolish. Okay, but we're gonna try to pair... First thing, we're gonna try to pair Giannis with another 95+. plus. Let's start with, um... Let's look at roster. Actually... LeBron is on a one plus one. 
James is Katie on a two plus one? He's on a two plus one. What about Steph, he's on a two. What about James, what we'll goes talk to James? He's in Houston, Boston. Oh, he's in Portland. We'll talk to Portland, then we'll talk to Boston. Forty-one million. How the heat? Oh, we were the heat. He's already untouchable. Alright. It's not like how I thought. Y'all get Clay, McCollum. That's fine. Let's take out McCollum. Karis Levert. Will Barton. Y'all give us. Y'all give us back Teague. We'll give up. CJ, y'all give us back. And we'll give up Surge. Y'all give us back Tristan. Okay. Really? They're not budging. Okay, I need to be smart. I need to be smart. L where is scouting team intel? Let's see. So they, yeah, everybody's already untouchable. Everybody got that set up. We can, we can go for Kyrie. Jokic will be the easiest guy we can trade for. LeBron is untouchable. They're not moving KD. Luca's untouchable. I don't know how the Hawks are rebuilding, but whatever. Dame is untouchable. Right now, my big target is Jokic. I don't know how he's not untouchable, but hey, they got Embiid untouchable. Oh, Cat's not untouchable. So it's Cat and Jokic. They're not trading Zion and they're rebuilding. Oh, Paul George. Steph is untouchable. Let's go get it. Let's go make a deal for Jokic. Let's make a deal for Jokic. Let's go straight to the trade finder. See if I can save myself some time. There's nothing, nothing crazy, bro. Nothing crazy. Okay, that's funny. Nothing crazy, bro, for Jokic, bro. Don't, don't, don't do nothing crazy, bro. This is a good deal. Let's see. They're all the same to you? How do you view my picks? Two star. Since they're all the same. Y'all have any bad deals y'all don't like? 
Y'all don't have no bad contract. How is this trade gonna work? You don't even want Karis. You can take Surge. Take Will Barton. Want Karis too? I thought they would accept that one. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to fleece the CPU like I thought, bro. Alright. It was Carl Anthony Towns. After that, I'll go for Kyrie. We want to build the most complete roster we can. Where's Cat? He's on this team the Pacers oh my gosh look at that value bro I can't even y'all gotta y'all gotta work with me here still got cat and oh this is a nice team bro Y'all don't like that deal, yeah. Y'all like that deal? Y'all like that deal with Doug McDermott? Y'all probably love that one. Well, y'all have a lot of money, so let me take Tremont off y'all hands. We'll give you back Surge. We'll take. You gotta give us back nine million. Okay. They're not budging. They are not budging. They're not budging. Okay. They're contending. We will try to trade for Kyrie, bro. He's look at the val. Yeah, no. I'm not even gonna waste my time. I'm not even gonna waste my time. Let's trade Finder Clay. Like, they're giving us realistic deals. I don't see one unrealistic deal on there, which is good. You know, that means the settings are doing what they're supposed to do. The deals haven't gotten any better when I put the picks. R Westbrook is intriguing. But no. Um, so, basically, Clay's not going anywhere. Now, let's look at CJ and this pick. Can I snag a 90? He's a 84? Really? Okay, 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 okay. Let's try to get us a good 85 overall player for Surge in this first. Bro, he, okay. We can get a rental of DeMar DeRozan. I don't think I'm I don't I think that's a pretty good deal let's look at our salary cap table next but we gotta bring back can we renegotiate Giannis undecided everybody's undecided under 19.5 Anthony you need to bring them expectations down my boy he Caleb he wants 19.5 million 19 and a half million 
19? Bring them back. Bring them X back. Is he restricted? No, he's got to. Okay, okay. Yeah, he's back. We don't care about where Surge goes. I think that's a good deal for us. We can't get Sabonis. We would want a Pascal. They want Giannis. I'm like, I don't even waste my time with that. It said, oh, yeah, we can give him up. Where's DeMar? What team was DeMar on? Orlando, Will Bart, they want that first. Will Bart, he at 80, right? I think what we do if we're the Heat, where's the Heat? Oh my gosh. Let's now let's do this. And also get Will Barton. Okay, who somebody gave me an offer for an eighty five. Oh, that was for CJ in this pick. We can get Okay, okay. Let's do CJ in that pick and see what, what comes up. We can get Vucevic. We can get Kemba. We can get Kristaps. They're literally telling us we can get any mid player. We can get Kimba straight up. We can get two firsts from New York. We can get Kimba. I kind of, I kind of low key. I like the idea of getting Kristaps. Now let's. Let's really take our balls and put them to the wall. I think I'd like the idea of a Kristaps Giannis duo. I don't know. Call me crazy, bro. Call me crazy. I like the idea of a Kristaps Giannis duo. A Kristaps Giannis duo in 2K, I think that's enough. So let's let's go talk to whoever team has Kristaps and see what they want. They want see this is no picks. I like this deal. Now we're giving up our future in Dwight Powell and Lou Dort. But we get Kristaps, who I feel like he's going to be able to bring us a lot more. Throw in your first. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, there we go. Now let's keep on. Now let's, let's come here. Let's come here. And let's do this. Let's do this. We've got Kristaps on the team now. Let's see if we can swing him for a 90. Which we can't, but we... Here's the thing. We're sitting on all of our picks right now. So we've got three players, and I want to turn like 285 out of them. So like Karis Levert, we are probably gonna. Oh, that's the, that's my team. I was about to say Zach Levine for Karis Levert, dang near straight up. I think out of all three of these guys, Karis is the most. They're all like equal value, which is crazy. 
Oh, really? They'll give me Damar? For all three? What will y'all give me for just these two? I throw my first in, they'll give me Damar? Oh, I like how I like how y'all talking to me, Orlando. I like it. Let's let's come back. Let's circle back to. They don't want Demar. It's obvious they don't want Demar. We'll give you. Here's what we'll do. We'll do a Demar rental. We'll just give up Surge. Two picks, a top three protected. No, 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 no. We know it's not gonna be a top three pick, but here's what we got for you. Let's start throwing in some seconds. Okay, let's let's start throwing in some pick swaps. Look at this. Damar will come here for these pick swaps. Now, let's look. They're they're not really budging, which is a little unfortunate. I want to see what Sir, if Surge and Will Barton is enough. They want my 21 first, which is cool. So if I come here and I like, okay, I'm like, this, what can I get? And I might have to probably make my own trade for this. Yeah, it's looking like I gotta make my own trade. 16 million. I need a rebuilding team. Where's team intel? Where's a rebuilding team? With a... It's how many years does Kimba have? He's on the bucks. Two plus one? I like that. I like that. For Karis? Oh, we would he's too expensive. They're buyers, they're rebuilding. How valuable is Trey Young to the Cavs? Sam. Uh, Tatum? Especially since he's on an expiring, right? They've got to at least think about it. White side. We would just have a lot of bigs, but he's on a one year now. K mid, but they're buying. I don't want to deal with a buying team. Pascal? How much is he making and how are the Pacers looking on the... I thought he was on the Pacers. It was a Jazz. They have a lot of salary cap room. Yeah, that's unfortunate for us. B.I.?
these are like modern trades. I gotta give up a king's ransom for some role players. Lord have mercy. Uh, they're contending. Ben Simmons. Did he just get his new deal though on the Lakers? Look at. Yeah. Eek. There really may not be a trade for me. There really might not be a trade for me. Westbrook? How do the Pelicans value Westbrook? Oh, Westbrook's making too much for me. Zion, they're not moving Zion. Drummond's making too much for me. Lowry's making too much. Gobert's making too much. I would assume Brad Beal's making too much. Devin Booker, I'm not sure. Devin Booker could still be on his rookie deal. No, he's making too much. Bam is not, but they're buying. Jimmy's making, okay, okay. So, John, how do you feel? Well... Will these two in this pick still get me the Mar? Yeah. Can, wait, wait. Can I just do Surge and a couple picks to get the Mar? Let me do Surge and these two, bro. Is this enough for me to get the Mar, the 24 and 25? I got to throw in Jalen McDaniels. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. I'll throw in my 23 and 24. Keep Jalen McDaniels out of it, and we've got a deal. Jalen LeCue, I can do that one. I can do this. I can do this. Okay. Kristaps at center, Giannis at the four. We don't have a PG, but I have these two that I'm going to try to move for a PG. Oh, not them two. Because I was going to say, I'll take Kimba. And we may go circle back on Kimba. Because he's been in trade talks all the time. Let's let's circle back on Kimba. Thirty four point all that million for Karis and Will. <gasps> no, I did not want to that is such a They fleeced me. They fleeced me. They fleeced me. They fleeced me, man. They fleeced me, man. Okay, how? That's all right. It's, they fleeced me. I did not think they would just accept that. Let's see what I can get for Maxi in the first. Can I get into the 85 range? I don't think yet. Yeah, or not. I can get into the 81 range, but... Okay. I don't want to just lose all my draft capital. That doesn't make any sense. Let's just sign players and get some draft capital from players we don't need. We're going to keep Jalen, keep Anthony, keep Seku. Actually, let's... Anthony, well, he's got one more year, and he's a restricted free agent. 
Oh yeah, somebody would have to match money with us. It'd have to be like a we'd have to do like a Ann Fernie Maxi Kleber deal. But um or a Anthony Evan Turner deal, really. Let's see, we can get Surge. But Surge did get us Damar. We would need to do a three teamer. Send Vucevic to the Heat. Send Surge to Philly. Send Nerlens to Philly. Okay. Oh yeah, it doesn't have to stop there. We can't get Vucevic. Can we get CP? Send send P to the heat. Oh, CP's too expensive. Montrez send Montrez to the magic so we'd get Nerlens the Cavs would get Surge I don't want I don't want Montrez though. he's a 84 I know I got an orchestrated three teamer. Uh, Hassan, we'll see. Not enough money. What if I send you to the Clippers? Oh. Wait. I sent you to the Clippers. Oh, yeah. Hassan comes to the Heat. Came in, probably makes too much. Lavino. Let's look at Sabonis. Sabonis to the Heat. Hornets. Heat. No, no, no. You come. Sabonis comes to the Heat. Third goes to the Hornets. Nerlens comes to heat. Y'all were just salivating over this deal. Really, y'all really want Surge that badly. Okay, do we have another pick? Let me do a good Hornets and Magic trade. I don't know. Give him a first or something. Give him a future first or something. So the Hornets really are hemmed up on Sabonis because the Heat are so greedy with the picks. 
Heat are so greedy with the picks. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna accept the deal and just keep search, bro. Okay, let me just sign. Yeah, let me sign free agents and flip them. Or let me I was checking to see who's on the Heat roster that I would want to flip. Um McLaughlin. We can keep Maxi. I don't, we don't need Maxi. He's 28, yeah. Let's flip Maxi. We'll flip McLaughlin. We'll flip, and we're trying to just accumulate draft capital at this point. Let's start with Maxi. Try to flip him for some draft capital. No, a top 10 protected. No, no, no way. Top 3 protected? That's pretty good to us. Unprotected first and a top three protected. That's pretty good to us. Two unprotected from the Raptors. That's pretty good. We'll take this. What's it called for an office? Yep, let's find some free agents to minimums. You get a second. A first from Boston? Are y'all kidding me? Rockets will give me a 22 first and a 21 second. I'll really get my second and 21. Ugh. Just gotta, just, just gonna be trading. We're gonna hold all the draft capital, even though I, ch oh, he's 22 though. Yeah, you stay. You're young. You stay. You're developing. Langston Galloway. Like if a team was willing to give me like a 80, you're like, I'm not going to trade them for a 22 first. That's foolish. Evan Turner. Next will give us a first. We give up a see, you know, now I'm gum now I'm here I am back at this. Could we flip sir? I I'm confident we could flip surge and some picks for another eighty five. I am real and then I'm I'm low key sinking. We try to trade for Lou Will as well. Let's first, like, do a raw surge. Look, we can get Karis LeVert back. Which isn't too bad. He's 26. He's a little old. Okay, so no. But, but once I, like... Let me throw these picks in there. You see, we got Zach Levine there. Also got Christian Wood. Oh, we don't. It's actually not looking goaded. Let's try to get another 80. We can throw into this trade. Those are those people are staying. They're not going anywhere. Mike Scott and Joe Keem for Doe in a second. We can get a top 10 pr protected, lottery protected. We might go to the Knicks and just take their top 3 protected. Top 3 protected in 23. We'll take their top 3 protected in 22.
Oh yeah, teams are just gonna give us their picks with all types of protections, and I'll take them. I don't care. A second. Nope. Twenty. Oh, that's our team. Twenty-two first, top ten protected. I'm just really waiting for Lou Will to pop up again. All right, let's go find Lou Will. He's at eighty-one. There he is. Nope. 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 Okay. But we, we need to flip Surge into an 80. Like, no matter what. We definitely gotta flip Surge. Surge has gotta go. Uh, no matter what, Surge has gotta be gone. But let's just trade. We got a lot of trading to do because there's a lot of picks that, and these teams don't value them like I told them to, which is fine, you know. 22 top 10. Twenty-three first. Wait, twenty-two top five protected from the Grizzlies. I think the Grizzlies deal is the best deal. At least they're not giving me like next year. Oh, they're giving me a top ten. And I think I'd rather just take the top five protected. Yeah. This is how both teams are going to build up their draft equity. The Celtics will give me a top three protected. So are the Timberwolves. I'll take it off of Boston. Oh, you're not going anywhere, my friend. The Hornets are going to help us out. Ooh, the Timberwolves really want to help us. They must see something in Bullock we don't. Top three protected. Yep, we're running low on trades, unfortunately. We are running a little bit low on reasonable trades. So that's, you know, not the worst thing in the world. It's actually pretty good. Okay, let me sign some more people. That might be it. Oh, no, that's not it. Okay. Well, we can move back. We don't really want to move back. Okay, so the so the teams have officially oh they want Dwayne though. Maybe. We can move from twenty four to twenty two. Move our second up. I think that's not bad. Moving our second up. Yeah, we'll move up from twenty twenty four to twenty twenty two. Let me get Charles Brown Junior, who I don't know. He's 23 and a 70. We'll keep him. Let's we'll see what he turns into. Alright. Oh, we can move from 25 to 22. And we get Adamo Schofield, somebody that I wanted. That's good. Oh, we're going to have a young core, bro. Look at all these young players we have on the team. My 
Might as well. It doesn't hurt to have all these players. Jay Dudley, 21. Uh, oh. oh, Lou Dort? Easy, easy trade, easy trade. Simple trade, easy trade. We've got so many young players now, bro. I wouldn't be surprised if we could flip a couple of these young players. Kai Bowman, 71 overall at 23. Like, he's... Yeah, like, why not take a Kai Bowman on the team? See what he could turn into. We got one more geezer on the team, Kim Birch. Cheek Dial. We're not giving up a pick. You got me messed up. Thinking we're going to move a pick. Yeah, no. Uh, he's... The 72, 24-year-old I was talking about, I thought about drafting. Um, Kim Birch, you're looking like you're just going to be on the team. Frank Jackson. We have Frank Jackson. Welcome to the team. Okay, so the Heat are fine. Yeah, we're running a five man. Kim Beth the one, Clay at the two, Damar. Unless if we now I have all these young players. And I'm like, okay, let's look at when I, when I look at potential, I'm like Kai Bowman, he's got pretty decent. Seku. Let's look at like somebody like Seku's trade value. See if we can get an 85. Ooh, the Clippers. Really? Y'all give up Hassan? I feel like that's something I can't look past. Seku and Surge. I keep my picks. He is only 19, though. I would prefer not. I will. Okay, let's look. Let's look. Let's come over here. Where's the Clippers? Come on, Clippers. Like, no, that's not a deal we want to do. That's not a deal we want to do either. Okay, let's go. Let's just try to come up with a straight-up trade. We'll give you all of our acquired draft capital. We got a trade exception. Worth $8.53 million. And we'll start throwing you seconds. We'll start throwing you seconds. We'll start throwing you seconds. <laughs> we'll start throwing you seconds. And y'all are like, nah. Which, if we, we've got 31 million, I think we can, we can do 31 million? Yeah, we can go for a Kyrie. Okay. Okay, okay. Now we're getting deep into the trade bag. We've got 31 million. We want to go to a rebuilding team. I don't think Jokic might be a little too much. Jokic is probably a little too high of an asking price. They're buying. Trey Young probably a little too high. We're watching you this time. Hassan? I don't know. Hi, Hassan just seems like such a mid move. Let's try Pascal on the Jazz. Let's see. He's under a four-year deal. He's got. A, he is very valuable, but I feel like this is a trade we have a better. I would feel a lot better about giving up all of my draft capital in this one. How do my picks hold no value to them? This is good though. 
they said we don't want them picks okay let's see like like let's look at the kings we'll do we'll give you surge how are these picks not valuable y'all are rebuilding I guess it is a little realistic like they're gonna be like we want to rebuild or oh they traded him they traded DI now we have no money pretty much but I knew I could do it one two three four five six a six man and we may try to hop up and get a 90. Let's see what Chris stops is worth. Can he get us a 90? We don't have too much draft capital anymore. Chris stop. They can get us dang near close. nobody really crazy because all the crazy players are untouchable well not all of them let's see let's see is there any 90s like on a rebuilding team they're contending okay let's let's try to let's try to make one last deal for Kyrie if I'm gonna give up anybody it's gonna be Damar would be the first guy I'd want to give up We'd give you um, all of our first. Y'all are not blown away by this deal? Okay. They don't want all of our first. Which is fine. Makes sense to me. We'll give you... He's a restricted free agent, though. He's going to be here for a while. Let's give you Kimba. You gotta make up twenty million. E give us Tim. Okay, no. It doesn't look like it's happening. <laughs> Jokic. Jokic could happen. I we could go get Jokic, pair him with Giannis. Y'all are rebuilding. Y'all are rebuilding. Y'all are rebuilding. Y'all are rebuilding. This is how this not a good Oh <gasps> A monumental deal for Jokic? No way, bro. I'm not cheesing. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Trade sign it's all on. Trade oh, trade frequency. Where is trade difficulty? It should be at fifty two. Oh, like I said, rating. Um, and these are crazy deals. Like, I'm giving up every single draft pick I have. Where is, it's probably in here then. Yeah, trade negotiation difficulty is that a fifty-two? It's not sweet. It's definitely not sweet. Um. Let's keep it going. Let who's that next ninety that we can take? Look at this team. Hold up. Look at this team. Who's the next ninety we can grab? Just let me know where they're at. We'll, we'll go. We'll go take them off of somebody's hands. Rebuilding, not Trey Young. Can't get KD. Can't get Luca. Giannis is on our team. Can't get Dame. Can't get Kawhi. Can't get AD. Can't get Embiid.
Can we really get Carl Anthony Towns? I'm gonna try. I don't know if we have the draft capital for it though. I think we can re-sign BI for like a really long term deal. We only have one more first. That's funny. Okay, let's try to give them... We'll do this. You gotta give me 27. Y'all have any deals y'all don't like? No. You're about the same. You want and Kimba and our first. Okay, this is this is like low key as good as it gets. <gasps> now you might be like John, you're sitting on all these sinners. Giannis <laughs> at the three. Jokic at the five, four. Now we can't. Oh, we need a bench. We got too many centers. Oh, man. Giannis got to play the one. Small forward point guard. Yeah, Giannis at the one. Yoke, what? Is, let me just. Where's you? Let me let me just do everyone. Small forward. Point guard. Let me just do everybody that's relevant. Ooh, Seiku. Small forward, power forward, that's fine. Power forward, center. Well, no, power forward, point guard. What about Anthony? He only jumps up to. Uh, yeah. I'm trying to con make my considerations. Because we got Steven Adams. We... Like Giannis can play the one, Clay at the two, Cat at the three, Jokic at the four, Stephen Adams at the five. We can get Demar back. I don't know, that kind of feels like a lateral move to me. For Jokic. Nothing crazy. What about for Cat? Nothing crazy. What about for Clay? Nothing crazy. But for Steven, we can get Damar back. On a one year, like all these bigs, we don't need all these bigs. And for me, I don't know. You're unrestricted, Isaiah. We're not gonna have your we're not gonna have your bird rights. What about you, Lou? We'll have yours. Jalen McDaniel, you're unrestricted. We'll have yours. All right, so Isaiah Hartenstein.
Well, you're, you're... We're not going to be able to resign him. You know, what, what, let me tell you my concern right now. My, my concern is this. But we do have, like, athletic wings. I think we should be okay. Like... Even if we did do Jokic at the one, is this like how are they? How many assists has he been averaging? Six. What's his playmaking? A minus. Giannis has A playmaking. I think we need players to win now. So I think Anthony and them, yeah, they're not safe anymore. Can I get an 85? I don't need all these bigs. Lou Williams, I don't know if he'll hit what we need. Neither did uh, Jonathan Isaac. I'd want somebody that's like a... But Seku's a very valuable player. We can go from Seku to Dinwiddie. I don't even know if I'll end up playing a game that ain't. Sakuda because we need Oh dear, you got too much. Can we I don't know if we could trade Seku for Trey Young. That might be a little too opportunistic. I think we could trade for Jaron Jackson Jr. And I know. Yeah, I feel like this is a trade they'll do. We'll just have a lot of bigs. Let's get Seku. Seku is the most valuable. Anthony's is he two and a half? Yeah, Anthony's two and a half. Isaiah's two. Admiral's one and a half. Ludor is one and a half. Yeah, I got to orchestrate a deal for a good wing. Maybe like a D Mitch. We just need like a... We need like one more. Because I don't know how we'll do in the sim without a point guard. That's what I'm concerned about. 83 Jamal Murray. He's making way too much money for us, though. Brogdon. I feel like we could make a trade for Brogdon. Gotta think, gotta think, gotta think, think, think. Bledsoe. We could make a move for Bledsoe. Oh, maybe Shay. Maybe that's who we need right now. Are we giving up too much money? Okay. Could we do a Seku for... Actually, give me... Let's try to do a Seku for... Shea deal, straight up.
No, they're not going for it. They're not going for it. They're like, no. No, no, no. Y'all aren't going to fleece us. Do y'all like bull? Y'all do like bull, bull. That's crazy. Y'all y'all don't like Wayne. We'll give up Anthony. This is a good deal. This is a good deal. At the time, not nowadays. I don't know. Maybe they would trade Anthony for a shame. Uh, Raptors, uh, I don't know. No, we're not getting Zion. I'm looking for a guard around like 84 overall. That's not too crazy expensive. Like, I saw a jaw. I gotta find him. He's too valuable. We could, we'll, I think, we'll just have to go for the Seku for Dinwiddie straight up and hope that he can play on the wing. That's our, that's our best bet. So we'll just sec, we'll do Trade Finder Seku. Or should I simulate a couple games? See, like, I'm thinking I might need to just sim a couple games. I think this trade isn't going anywhere. I really do. Because, you know, Seku's 1973 with B plus potential. And if I trade for Dinwiddie, I don't know if his overall will hit the 85 plus that I'm looking for. The hop on the court. We gotta we gotta get a couple games in. We gotta get a couple games in. So What's our game plan? Giannis at the one, Clay at the two, Kat, Jokic, Steven Adams with Spo, Heat Playbook. I don't care who's our first scoring option. I guess we have Giannis, Clay. Yeah. Oh, we'll be patient. We'll crash the old glass. Net neutral. And we'll crash this glass. We need all them boys said see now I'm like maybe I should have kept training effects at fifty, but I think I won't be able to cheese. So this is the this team, Hawks. Okay, so now I gotta worry about the Hawks. What are we gonna do? I think to start, like I'm reconstructing this whole roster like from the ground up. I don't know. We got Levine. Like, can I get a bit? Let's see, like, you know, every time I play a season, I always want a Ben Simmons. Like, could we just... Could we just get, like, Ben on the team? He's got contact finisher. What do y'all want? I feel like I could trade for Ben. I really do. I don't know if I want to, though. Who's faster? I feel like it's Ben, it's LeBron, it's Giannis. Why don't I try to get both on the team? We don't need Brooke Lopez. Oh my god, they think we're gonna suck? Oh yeah, they're gonna give us Ben Simmons. We'll be fine. Look at this. <sighs> My heart hurts. Cause I feel like this is cheating. But I don't care. 
Welcome to the team, Ben. Welcome to the team, Ben. Okay, okay. We know we can get Ben Simmons. Let's try to get him without giving up someone we want on the team. Do we really want Bro What was he here for? What's he here for? Cold Intimidator. We wanted that. We need Omo Bamba. He's our starting big. We need JJ. Marcus. Oh. oh, yeah. We need Chris Dunn. We'll keep D Green. Yeah, we don't want Okogi. Okay. Okogi for Ben. And you can have all of our picks. Yep. We're right back where we were. Welcome to the team. Welcome to the team. We're not going to suck. I don't know why the CPU thinks we're going to suck this year. Let's give them the picks in the future. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me make sure this is who I want. What's his speed? Before I give up my whole freaking roster for him. 93 speed, yeah. Yeah, that's who I want. That's exactly what I want. That's ex this is the... This is exactly who I want on the team. Okay. No, no. Y'all are playing hardball. I understand that. I would do it too. I'll do it too. I will do it too. Okay. We have to give up every single pick we had. <laughs> ben Simmons and Zach Levine as the slasher duo? With Hamidou off the bench? Now, now we just upgrade. So what I want is I need a lock. I need a lock. I need another lock to go over. Because right now, I'm thinking Chris Dunn at the one, Levine at the two. I need someone to play the three, Ben at the four, Mo Bamba at the five. So I need to upgrade a defender. I think... It will probably be Michael Kidd Gilchrist getting upgraded. We need to, what do I want? I want somebody. What type of player am I looking? I need someone, I need some, I'm looking at badges really. Someone that can be in the press. Maybe like, I need a reacher that can be up in the press. Was that all offense? Box. We can't get Kawhi. Actually, maybe... I think Interceptor. I think Interceptor is what we need. Drew Holiday, that would be pretty good. I don't want Ben Simmons up in the press. I don't want him exhausted. We can go get a Mikhail Bridges, though. That wouldn't be too terrible. He's on a one plus one. We don't know if we'd be able to... We have a lot of money, though. Or Drew Holiday. I don't know about Drew Holiday. I like Mikhail Bridges to be our last lock. And he's got pickpocket. What's his speed? Doesn't matter. Alright, let's let's go ahead and trade Michael Kidd Gilchrist for Mikhail Bridges. 
on Houston. Brooke Lopez. Is he our backup? Is Brooke Lopez our backup big? Could, will we be fine? Could we get by with Mark Gasol? Oh, Brooke Lopez got no speed. Can we do Brooke Lopez for me, Cal, straight up? I, I don't mind that. That's a good deal to me. Yeah, Brooke Lopez, he's not going to be able to move. You give us back a first. They want JJ, but they'll give us a first. Mm, I think JJ JJ is too good of a shooter. What about you give me a first in 2025? Wow, they don't want to give me a first at all. I don't care, bro. Really? I gotta give up Kyle Corver and a second for me, Kyle. Oh. I would much rather just give up um Bro, we're not giving up Kyle Corver, bro. We going we might just need him. Jordan McLaughlin, that doesn't make it any better. That doesn't make the deal any sweeter. Daniel Gafford It doesn't make the deal any sweeter, my friend. There we go. What? Monte Morris? That doesn't make it any sweeter, bro. Come on. Don't be ignorant. There we go. Now we're, we have no draft capital, so we got to sign some players. Oh my gosh. We can only sign one player. Lord have mercy. We get a second from Boston. We'll just take the second. We'll take the second and keep on walking. <laughs> Boston will give us a second. We'll just take the second and keep on pushing. Uh, Joakim. This is going to be an interesting season, since, especially since I'm playing more minutes per game. I gotta give up. We swap seconds. I don't mind that. Then I can get another player. So, really, we're able to um, get an, an additional pick. Since we uh, swapped and we didn't get a player in return. I'm not trading Kyle Corver. Not, not quite yet. We need to. Um, okay. Now let's look at our roster. Ben Simmons is good. He's good. He's good. We want a shooter that can defend it. So right now our starting five is, uh, who's at the one? Chris Dunn at the one. Mikal at the two. Zach Levine at the three, Ben at the four, Mobamba at the five. That is our starting five right now. Actually, actually, we'll have we'll just have Mikhail go and guard the guards. So probably Ben at the one, Levine at the two, and then Ben and Levine are gonna play like staggered minutes. <laughs> so they're both not on the court at the same time. Now we've got Redick, who's a shooter. We've got Gasol, that's our backup center. And we've got Ed Davis that's gonna help if Mo Bamba's just bad. We could use a rim protector. Who doesn't need to be here? 
MKG don't need to be here. We need a we need a big man with a little bit of um what's that badge? Rim protector yeah, rim protector. That box out Rebound Chaser, Pogo Stick, Worm, Back Down Oh my gosh, don't make this so tough. Where's RP? This is shooting relentless. Here's Rim Protector. I don't know. We don't have enough money for Gobert, I don't think. Steven, I don't think we have enough for Steven. We don't have enough assets for Bam. We traded away Brooke for our defender, so I'm not, can't cry about it. Clint's got it on silver though, so I'm like, hey, all these bigs got it on silver pretty much, so, oh, we've got Mark Gasol, but let's see his, let's compare their speeds. Thirty-eight. Dwight has 70 speed. I think I might go get Dwight. Clint. Let's look at Mitchell Robinson and Clint. They really have Dwight Howard with 70 speed. Let's go and try to trade for Dwight. We have a lot of money. We low key could try to trade. We have 23 million. I don't know if we have the assets to pull it off, but we might as well try, right? For a go bear, I think we we might as well try for a go bear. And then if not, then we'll get the white. What team is go bear on? You know, on Philly? It's on the Spurs. Go bear. We gotta make up two point nine one million. I don't want to trade Ed Davis. Yeah, camera if you were the other odd one out. Okay, MKG, or I think, yeah, you're the odd one out, my boy. See, uh, we traded all of our assets. Okay, well, what team was the white on? He was on Dallas. Gotta give up Danny Green. I don't want to do that. Not really. Do I want to give up Cam Reddish for a room protector? Is Cam Reddish going to sniff the court? What is he going to do for us? What is Cam Reddish going to do for us? He's... He don't got the badges, but he's got a 76 three-point... He's not going to hit his first... But he's got Interceptor. I was imagining... Like, off the bench, we're going to play a lot of... Sm he can be like a small ball two or three. Especially when I don't want to play... Um... Mm, 
pretty good, Tony. Especially when I don't want to play JJ. When we need defense, I feel like Cam Reddish. What's his speed? I feel like he's got like 84, 85 speed. I'm not going to. If he has 85, yeah, I'm not giving Cam Reddish up for the white. We got to. Hey, Michael, you got to figure it out then. You're going to be our 6'6 center. <laughs> you are going to be our 6'6 six, six backup center. We don't got no room. For we got Mo Bamba. We'll start. And you're off the bench center. You and Ed Davis. Because, yeah, Mark Gasol, he's only, he's only coming in like... When we've got shooters around him. And we're going to have to like be running a lot of pick and roll with him. So yeah, we can't get the white. We can't get our inside big. He's a lock. He stays. 3 and D guard. He's going to be good because if we ever need someone that can shoot. Like if we ever get into a situation where we need players that can somewhat shoot. And play defense, it'll be the lineup of we'll have our slasher. Danny Green will be in there. You know. We need another three and we could use another three and D guy. Oh Cam Cam Reddish needs to develop, but Kyle Corver. Can we get a three and D player for Corver? Not one that's ready. That's unfortunate. This may this is gonna be a long year. We don't got no <sighs> I may need to do auto subs. That's what I'm thinking. Oh, Gary Payton. Yeah, but he can't shoot. Let's look at... Like, Tony Snell, that was a rogue pickup. Because he can kind of shoot. We'll just see, bro. What's his attributes? I think Slat, we've got Ben and Levine. We don't need Hamadou anymore. Tory Craig, that's a very intriguing player. He's got good defense, no shooting badges. 77 three ball, he's just like um buddy. What's your three ball? 50. Yeah, I don't know. 93 driving dunk though? I don't know how much you might be he's probably staying. Tony, can I like upgrade Tony? I can we can get Dorian Finney Smith. 81 three ball. Not really good D badges. Darius Miller. Not really good D. That's the, that's the main thing we keep on circling back to. Like we can't. We don't have. Like I don't know. I don't want to get an Avery Bradley. Even though it is an upgrade. He's got clamps. What's your shooting? A my what's your overall? 80? But then we gotta give up a second. Go we go down. But we get the clamps. No, he's six six. If anything, y'all need to be giving up a pick. And then Ed Davis, he's gonna help us. He's gonna help us immensely on the glass. If it ever comes to that point where we need someone to get on the glass. Gary Payton. He's he's a reacher. He's gonna be up in the press with our norm with the getting Macau Bridges or someone. MKG okay, could I could I package MKG. Let me come. 
I don't have we don't have nothing in mind really And then Or would I start only one of them and have them like split the minutes? I think no, I think I'll attack it like this. And then Hamid, because Hamidu is up here as our sixth man. Give him a minute. Hamidu's up here as our sixth man, our backup slash. Who's our backup defenders? That's Gary Payton is one of them. So is Danny. Who's backing up Mo Bamba? That's Ed Davis. And Mark Gasol. Those are all of our key backups. So now we have three slots and five players. We need our shooters. So JJ's in here, guaranteed. Corver? Corver should be here. Right? Yeah, Corver should be here because we might need threes. So then we got Cam Reddish, who. That's what. This is what must be why all these players be getting DNPs. Oh, one second. 